Welcome to the third tutorial video of the Modular X Machine Vision software. In this video I'm going to show you some tricks how to quality control the soldering of through hole mounted devices. Let's use the similar step to acquire our images from the hard disk. By the way you can download these images, the link is provided in the description of the video. Therefore you can follow the step by step instructions. Let's take a look. Click on forward to cycle through the image directory, click on the exit button and then just go through the images. As you can see there are the soldering points and the typical defects are that there isn't enough solder like here or it's not correctly soldered or there are short circuit on the image and this time I'm going to show you how to detect these defects on the image. I consider that a good soldering point is that when it is bright enough and the area of the found objects is between a given range. So what does it mean and how can you measure it? It's really easy. Just go to the locate features. Let's look for an image. Yes, it's going to be good. So let's go to the locate features and detect objects. Let's just draw a ROI around the soldering points. Let's name it like detect soldering. We are looking for bright objects. Set the threshold value to 65 or 60 is better. And then you can see the results over here of the measurements. This is the index of the found object. It means it found 15 objects and there are the data for each one in this table. And you can read that the area is 3231 and so on for all of them. So we can say that a good soldering point is that those value, this area values above 3000. So I say for the first time let's just set this criteria to 2950 and then just click on the accept button but before we do that let's just pass inspection if we found minimum 15 objects and maximum 15 objects so let's click on the accept button and let's see how it works yeah these are the good soldering points yes and now these are good but this function didn't find them so let's just check it out what's the problem I guess it's because of the criteria so let's just say uh, 2800 yes and it works pretty well click on the accept button and now as you can see it found also the short circuit here it's not good but we can filter those defects by just setting the maximum object size so let's measure uh, that's the first object over there so let's just measure the area of the objects it's 5490 so it's so big I guess we can set this object size criteria to 3500 and it will work pretty well yes also we filter this one because it's also not a correct solder soldering out there too much solder on it so with the object size you can just filter these let's just use the zoom, zoom to fit you can use it by right click on the image and just zoom to fit and let's see how it works 
that we got because all the soldering points are great and perfect and now we detect only the good soldering here also so you see it's so easy it works pretty well for the first time so we almost finished there's just only one step left to do is to measure the pixel values around the, uh, the solder pin so you can do that by to develop to develop in a full loop and it goes less or equal until measurement the detect soldering object numbers that's 15 click on the accept button let's close the full loop and for indexing and modular X you can use the array operator and select the data you want to index it is like the X and Y position of the object select the indexing uh, it is for loop cycle index click on the accept button open the for loop and you can see the array operator appears here so now it's time to create the ROI locate features create a ROI the ROI type in this case is analyst the center X is going to be the array operator X position the Y is going to be the array operator Y position the inner radius is must be I guess it is 16 and the outer radius is 25 yes it's gonna be good let's click on the accept button and now measure features and let's use the function called count pixels and set the threshold value to 40 we are looking for right object it's correct and set the minimum percentage to 75 and let's use the region of interest called ROI 0 so now it's using the ROI we have set up before and let's click on the accept button and another important thing is to break the for loop uh, when this complex step founds a failed part because then we don't have to continue the process so make, an, make a condition when the count pixel step status falls let's close the if then break and all you have to do now is just to set the session status you can do that by uh, the logical calculator first to calculate the result and you have to add two step results the count pixel step status when it's true and the detect soldering step status when it found all the objects and when these values are true click on the accept button set the session status equals to specify measurement select the logic zero logical result accept and now let's see what happens let's run our session all the soldering points are good so the session status passed in this case also and now it's it's failed because we got failed parts in the image we didn't find all the objects we expected for and that's why it fails so it's all that's all thanks for watching this video i hope it was helpful and keep updated because we're going to post more videos related using the software thanks for watching have a nice day and bye